Welcome back to Brick by Brick. Today, we'll be talking about how you can start your LEGO investing business with only $15. I started investing in LEGO when I was 12 years old. I loved LEGOs, I loved playing with them, I loved thumbing through the catalog every time it came and seeing and memorizing all the sets and their prices, and I loved building them and playing with friends uh, with LEGOs, and they were my favorite toy by far. And I was ecstatic to learn that I could somehow make money off of my passion with Lego. Um, so I didn't use that much money to start my Lego investing business. I probably spent about $50 to get it started, but it's possible to do it with even less. Um, today I'm gonna to show you three sets that are good examples of some of the first things you can purchase as a Lego investor if you're starting out with just uh, $15. There's often a stigma surrounded by investing that if you want any chance of making money, you're going to need to fork over thousands of dollars to risk to make a profit. That's not true. With most forms of investing, you can do it by just putting small amounts in and eventually you'll make money out of the small amounts. Obviously, it won't be as much as if you had forked over a lot of cash, but it's much better than nothing. So. Uh, I'm going to show examples of three sets that I think uh, if sets like them are reproduced by Lego, that they would be good ones to start off your investing, uh, Lego investing business with. So this one I've talked about before. It's the Sith Trooper Battle Pack. Uh, it has three very red, unique minifigures, and then the general guy. So these battle packs are great. Usually they will double in value pretty quickly. Uh, I've found that of the sets I've invested in, they're gonna double in value faster than most. So another option is the uh, Mandalorian uh, Battle Pack has four unique minifigures that are all uh, very differently colored and just a very vibrant set. Uh, and then finally, the uh, Lego Aragog's Lair with Harry Potter. Uh, Harry Potter can be a riskier investment, but it can pay off. So Lego, there's a chance that they will start reproducing or start producing these sets after the holidays because right now they're all sold out. Like I said in a previous video, I don't recommend buying Lego sets to invest in right now. I do recommend selling them though. So you may not be able to find these sets exactly, but Lego will make more Star Wars battle packs. It's almost certain. So if you're new to investing, I recommend starting with uh, one or two battle packs or however many you can afford and seeing where you can go from then. I will make more videos about starting with Lego investing with higher and higher budgets, but just know it's possible to start with only $15. Thank you.